Welcome to The Know. I'm Meg Turney. And I'm Ryan Haywood. And this is one of those news stories where everyone is going to have a different opinion of who's right and who's being foolish and everything else. So put on your thinking cap and prepare yourself for the cluster jam in the comments section. Yeah, if you're a fan of Let's Players on YouTube, you might be familiar with Angry Joe Vargas. Oh, Angry Joe. Good old. <laughs> Vargas recently posted a Let's Play of him and four friends playing Mario Party 10 on YouTube. Now, I know what you're thinking. Wait a minute, Meg. Everybody knows you're not supposed to post Nintendo gameplay videos on YouTube without getting them approved by Nintendo and then giving Nintendo a cut of your revenue. You are so right. And since Vargas didn't get his video approved as part of Nintendo's creator program, he was hit with a copyright claim for the, for the video and Nintendo took all of the ad revenue. Surprise, surprise. Mm. By the way, N Mario Party 10 isn't actually listed on the current list of games you can make videos of, even with Nintendo's approval. So going through the creator program wouldn't have kept this from happening. Rather than dispute Nintendo's claim, Vargas chose to remove the video altogether and posted a tweet along with a screenshot of the video that said, I hope at Nintendo America enjoyed the free ad revenue and coverage I generated for them. It will be my last Nintendo video. Well, that wasn't entirely true because he followed that up with another Nintendo video this time. It wasn't gameplay, but an 11 minute long rant against Nintendo's YouTube policies. In it, he accuses the gaming giant of being greedy, saying it should be enough for him to have purchased the game and the console it's played on, and that he should be allowed to share his experiences with whoever he chooses, however he chooses, because again, he already paid for it. He goes on to say he's washing his hands of Nintendo altogether and will no longer be featuring them on his channel, and even tries to nip haters in the bud by saying, and before you haters even fucking say it, yes, Nintendo may have a legal basis to be a fucking dick, but it doesn't mean they have to do this. I got you to say fucking it. It's so exciting. I know. Exciting. There's no G in the quote, so I you know. have to say he it says like that. It like that. I know. <laughs> All right, well, it turns out the legal basis wasn't actually the sticking point for a very famous detractor who had an issue with Vargas. It was Vargas's attitude. Yeah, David Scott Jaffe, who created God of War, had this to say on Twitter. I really love watching gaming Twitch streams and Let's Plays. That said, the arrogance and ignorance of some of these YouTube broadcasters, it just floors me. If a company doesn't want you using their stuff, which I do think is pretty dumb, then that is their right. They don't owe you the right to use their content so you can make your videos. Most of us in games want our shit streamed and talked about, but you've got to respect those companies that want no part of it. You know. You know. Now the thing that really gets me here is that yes, I think we can all agree that Nintendo's policy is dumb. Nobody thinks this is a good idea, but this shit didn't start yesterday. They announced their guidelines back in January. You knew that content was gonna get flagged. Everyone whose job it is to make video game content knows these rules. And whether or not you agree with them, you know them. So it's really strange to me that you're upset that they're enforcing the rules that they announced months ago. It all seems Seems very fishy to me, and I agree with Jaffe. The rule is dumb, but you have to respect them for not wanting their games covered without their getting a percentage. This doesn't seem like YouTuber gets screwed by Nintendo to me. This seems like YouTuber does something he knows is wrong, gets mad when he gets called out for it being wrong. Ryan? Yeah, as much as I hate to agree, this really does seem like a clear cut case of you were told not to do that, and you did it anyway. Yeah! And then you got surprised! Surprised. Stupid. Dumb. <laughs> I almost said surprise, bitch. And I should know. <laughs> so, what do you guys think? Let us know in the comments. And don't forget, you get the best in video games and entertainment right here, so be sure to like this video and subscribe to this channel, and we'll keep you in the know.